SafeMoon has published a new article that details more about their cross-chain supply and the design moving forward with this. We also have a little bit of discussion going on regarding the bridging. And with that being said, let's go ahead and start off here with that of the bridging. So we can see SafeMoon Spidey posting this screenshot off of the SafeMoon Discord. The question was asked, do we have any unofficial slash official word on bridge for Polygon chain release date? John Caroni responded to this saying, I have an internal timeline. Main docket item right now is the stress test. There are other more granular items, but that is the big one we are completing. Please do not take this as an indication of timeline. Then in addition to that, we also have <clears throat> here from the Discord, this pertaining to the cross chain and the SafeMoon NFT marketplace. So the question here, so correct me if I am wrong, does cross-chain need to happen before SafeMoon NFT Marketplace? And IMSD responded by saying, the answer is that the NFT Marketplace and cross-chain are not dependent. They are not dependent upon each other. And then from SafeMoon Insider, they say SafeMoon's cross-chain supply, a pairing on Ethereum and a pairing on Polygon was recently introduced. Our recent article aims to provide clarity and explain the rationale behind these added pairings and how they affect SafeMoon's overall supply. They then provide a link over to the education page, which I'm going to go ahead and read to you guys right now. SafeMoon cross-chain supply. We recently introduced two new pairings, one on Ethereum and the other on Polygon. To address the potential confusion within the community regarding the token supply, we want to explain the rationale behind these pairings and how they affect SafeMoon's overall supply. Our aim is to provide clarity on this process and its significance. On each blockchain, there is a representation of 1 trillion total supply that originates from the deployer wallet. However, the circulating supply or the supply available for trading will never exceed 1 trillion across all chains, taking into account the actual circulating supply. The SafeMoon token's circulating supply always stems from the Binance Smart Chain BSC, which we aim to leverage when setting up our liquidity pairings on the two new blockchains. All tokens originate from Binance Smart, the Binance Smart Chain BSC. And so in recap, in summary, there will never be more than 1 trillion SafeMoon tokens in circulating supply across all chains. Currently, this is the Binance Smart Chain, Polygon, and Ethereum, including the Burn Wallet. Notice that they say here currently, meaning that there is a strong indicator we will see additional chains moving out in the for uh, moving forward in the future, of which I've mentioned this before. I'll say it again. I would love them to add this to Avalanche, AVAX. All SafeMoon tokens must come from the original supply, which in this case is the Binance Smart Chain. The only way to initiate the circulation of tokens on other chains is to bridge them from Binance Smart Chain. The circulating supply refers to the tradable tokens that are available, excluding the amount held in the burn wallet. This burn wallet amount represents the sum of all three burn wallets across the three chains. To seed the two additional chains, SafeMoon tokens were bridged from the Binance Smart Chain supply to Ethereum and Polygon. Moreover, if you burn tokens into the burn wallet on either of the new chains, those tokens are permanently burnt and never return to the originating BSC chain. Please note that as we progress into the operation of a cross-chain bridge, further clarification and insights into its workings will be offered for improved understanding. Additionally, it is crucial to acknowledge that the mechanics in this evolving landscape are subject to change. So there's a possibility this stuff will change. Here's the graphic that was being shown on the page here. And as you can see down there in the center, the Binance Smart Chain, and it divvies it up. So you got 1 billion circulating supply, 1 billion circulating supply, the tokens bridge from BSC to create the initial Polygon supply, and the same thing for that of the Ethereum side. Down on the bottom, the disclaimer, please note that this is just the initial movement to begin operating on Ethereum and Polygon. As we progress into the operation of a cross-chain bridge, further clarification and insights into its workings will be offered to improved understanding, for improved understanding. Additionally, it is crucial to acknowledge that the mechanics in this evolving landscape are subject to change. Are subject to change. 
I don't know if they are going to change it, but they are subject to change. So do remember that very key element. And that's what I got for you guys in today's video. In regards to this, I may or may not still do another video. Depends on what I can find and what seems relevant. So keep an eye out for that. You can always turn the bell notification on. I do cover other cryptos as well from time to time outside of SafeMoon. If you guys have not ever checked out any of those videos, gives you an opportunity to see what else is out there, what's going on. So feel free to do that. I do appreciate all of you guys, whether you do watch those or not. I appreciate you guys being here and showing your support. And thank you to my Patreon supporters as well. A double shout out. Thank you to WeLoveSafeMoon.com, Victor Vegas, SafeMoon Oz for being higher level patrons. Thank you to my YouTube members for your support as well. And if you guys want to, you can check out the video I have a link to in the description below on Spritz Finance. I have paid for bills in the real world using cryptocurrency. In that example, I use BNB. They have a list of options. If you use my referral, you can be able to get a bonus for one of your future bill payments. Feel free to check that out if you would like. You can learn more details about that over there. Thank you so much. Don't forget to hit subscribe, hit the thumbs up, like button. God bless, and we will see you in the next episode.